What's up everyone? My name is Chance and I'm here to expose the real truth here on Facebook about what the troll community or these people that call themselves the troll community do. And I know this is probably going to get reported, but I don't care. These five people that I'm about to sh these I'm gonna yeah these five people I'm about to show you guys, including myself. Outside of myself, I'm their sixth. These five people I'm about to show you are victims of cyberbullying, starting with the main one. The main one, Chris Chan. These people have been harassing him since 2001, and they coaxed him into doing stuff to his grandmother that got him arrested. Suplex City Vlogs. Quiet Kid. Talks a lot about wrestling and stuff like that. They got him to say and do things for them that were very wrong. Heather, aka Queen's Court. They made her flash herself on live stream. As well as made her believe that the United States was under attack from a nuclear bomb threat. As well as called her sister and got them on live stream with her. When she is not supposed to be around nor talking to her sister in any way, shape, or form. Tony. The Black Dragon Lord. They got him to smear ketchup on his body while screaming that he wanted to be in the Bender Boys on a live stream. And ladies and gentlemen, the main culprit of all this stuff going on for their own entertainment, Kiwi Tapes. Also more commonly known as Kiwi Farms. Now, Kiwi Farms has many different groups that do stuff like this. That target people like myself. And target the people that I showed you. Um... What they did to me was uncalled for and unlawful. See, Music Biz Marty had gotten Mass Hole Reports, who is a major channel to entrap me and people say that you know what she did was okay when I have no priors I was never convicted of any pedophilic crimes I've never been convicted and I've never been arrested for such crimes the other day I decided to do some research and what did you know I found it right here and this is straight from a government website themselves. Only government agents can commit entrapment, not a private citizen. If a defendant and their legal team can prove that the police entrapment occurred and they would not have committed the criminal act without inducement, 
then their criminal charges can be dropped entirely. Right there, people. Taken straight from the United States government website. The first statement from the government website. Right there on Google. From the United States government website. What these people have done to me is wrong. Kate Peters, a.k.a. Mass Hole Reports, who also goes by Mass Troll Mafia, pretended to be 18 years of age, tricked me into sending her a photo of myself, turned around and sent one to me in return, and then turned around and claimed to be underage after the photo was sent. And ever since, that same story has been twisted around, edited, and all kinds of stuff to suit their needs. Now you're probably thinking, what do me and these people have in common? That I showed you at the very beginning of this video. That's simple. All these people have one thing in common. These trolls, these evil people that attack people like myself and the ones that I showed you, they try to entrap them and make them look like pedophiles all for their own self gain when these people do not give them what they want. And it's not okay. These people are illegally doing stuff to people that's not okay with me they took it to the extreme with me they really did they mentally abused me verbally and emotionally harassed me assaulted me physically tried to have me killed by having somebody shoot at me through my bedroom window And they, do, they did all this because I did not give them what they wanted. All the rage outs I have ever done. Every rage out that I've had. Everything that I've said that was very wrong to the highest extent. Was a result of me being bullied. Over and over relentlessly. And it's not right. What these people have done is wrong. And never should have happened. And people are always asking, why am I now back on YouTube? I'll tell you why. Because I'm not going to be on a platform where toxicity reigns rampant. I'm speaking out against these people. These groups involved involve the main people which are Nicholas Beagler, a.k.a. Music Biz Marty. William Glory Hole. CVG 2.0, a.k.a. Cyrax Video Games. Mass Troll Mafia. Bass Shaman. Metal Gear Rax. And Fed Smoker. These seven people are the main ones that commit these crimes along with everybody else in their group as a collective. With me, they took it to a very, very high extreme. They blackmailed me into sticking certain items where they don't belong. They forced me to commit sexual acts to myself on live stream.
they made me send them certain videos of me doing sexual acts. These people manipulated me mentally and verbally. And when these people blackmailed me into doing this stuff, they said that I either do this or my family was going to be attacked. And when I finally stood up and I said I had enough. When I finally stood up and said enough is enough. My family did get attacked. And it's not right. And what makes things worse is the Akron Police Department are involved in it. The Akron Police seem to think that. You know what I'm doing is my fault. When I've been manipulated and harassed and attacked over and over and over and over again and forced to do these things that are not okay. And do I regret them? Yes. Do I regret the shit that I've said to people? Yes. But you have to understand, I was attacked. I was maimed, dehumanized, and victimized. The same as many of these other people. And what's sad is YouTube's allowing this to happen. They're just letting it happen. You know, before all this started, I had a life. I was a full-time Twitch streamer. I was making money every month. I was able to provide for my family. And I was doing good. I was working on music. I had just dropped two albums back-to-back -back that year. And I was on the road to success. Both financially... And physically, I was on the road to success. I was actually planning on a tour that next year. After my second album dropped, I was planning on a tour for that next year. For my albums Blackout and Evolution. Which were both my first two dubstep albums. I was planning on doing a tour that, that following year. But due to all the stuff that's going on, that never got to happen. Those things never came to fruition. What these people are doing is wrong. And something needs to be done about it. So I'm calling on everyone that sees this video that knows that I'm not a bad person. I need you all in my friends list to share this around to your friends, your family, the authorities. Get people involved. Share this with everybody that you know that you can. Share it to everyone on your friends list. Share it to everybody that you know. Because this has got to stop people. These people, these evil people make money off of people's misery like mine. And the other people that I showed you in the very beginning of the video. Do some of them have a past? Yes. But let's be honest, we all have skeletons in our closet. No one's perfect. We've all done things that we shouldn't have done. We've all done stuff that we regret. But this has got to stop. We need to put an end to this. 
Like I said, I want you guys to please share this video with everyone. Share it with your friends, your family, everyone in your friends list. I want this video to go viral on Facebook and all over every platform that you can get it on and expose these people for what they're doing. This has got to stop. Because eventually someone's going to take their life as a result of what these people do. I know I attempted to take my own life twice because of these people. This has got to stop, guys. People have actually taken their lives because of these people. And eventually more is going to come if they are not stopped. So I'm asking everyone that sees this, that's on my friends list, share this with everybody that you know. And I mean everyone. Even if they don't want to see it, make them see it. Make them watch it. Please, guys, this has got to stop. Let's make a difference. Let's bring these guys down and put a stop to this. Peace.